We want to make a change, and I think this is our way of saying, hey, we want to help too. To make sure that Stoneman Douglas knows that we hear them, we see them, and we support them. Somewhere I read, your words carry amazing power. One kind word can change someone's entire day. Students in the Lakota School District are sharing their words with students who are more than a thousand miles away. We do feel, though, for uh, Stoneman Douglas, and we are trying to show our support for them because we know that this is a hard time, and there's nothing that can really change it, but they need to know that people are here and they care for them and that we're all ready to help. These students are sending handwritten letters to young people in Parkland, Florida. It's also their statement of solidarity. Stay strong. We are all grieving with you guys. Know this, please. We love all of you. God protect each and every one of you. We are in this together. I am terribly sorry for the tragedy that you and your community have recently been through. I am praying for you and your families to heal quickly and remember the good times with your loved ones. Stay strong. Things will get better with time. We have great kids here. I can't imagine how the kids in the community feel down there. And we hope we never have to deal with this. Um, we want to be prepared let people know that we're going to try to protect our kids the best we can, and we're here for them. Here at Lakota West, they're also encouraging students to sign this banner that they will send along with, they hope, at least 1,000 notes. Dear students, you have been so strong despite what you have gone through. I'm so sorry for your losses. Well, tomorrow, all Lakota students are asked to wear Stoneman school colors as a sign of support. As far as a solidarity walkout, the principal told me they are looking at a way for students to express themselves in a safe manner. I'm Curtis Fuller, WLWT News 5.